I know the substructure seems lacking, but I've been working this formula for quite some time now. I'm just missing the final piece. Red nettle. It contains atropine and tetradryl, which not only slow the decay, but bolster the weakened immune system. It's far from a guarantee, and I'm going to need some time. But statistically speaking, I give each patient a 67.3% chance of living. Thanks. English, please. All we need to know is what we need and where we can find it. Well, therein lies the challenge. I haven't been able to pinpoint an exact location of the nettle yet. But based on the data we've received from previous runs, I've located the area with the highest ANT readings. Right there. That area is 20 miles wide. How do you expect us to find that thing? I've sent you all the picture. Just go out and look around, I suppose. Also, I updated your T7 scanners. You should be able to identify it if you find it. We'll load up tonight and we'll head out in the morning. You need, you need to go now. We lost three more this morning. We're running out of time. We'll get what we need and we'll head out. And Victor, if you happen to find it, dig up as much as you can and put it in there. Whatever you say, boss. So close. Victor! Spencer should have everything he needs for the cure. Good work, brother. Spencer should have everything he needs for the cure. Good work, brother. Where were they? The 43rd quadrant, just east of the main road. They had a vehicle with all kinds of supplies. I put a tracker on it. They stopped here. The satellite scan shows a fairly large compound that I didn't even know existed. It is partially covered by a large cluster of trees. You don't... you don't think they found a... What? A cure? I guess we'll just have to find out. Let's load up and roll out.
quite the place you've got here. It's getting kind of dark out. You want to invite me inside? Or? I wasn't aware there was still any living things still in this place. If you could call this living. Who are you and what do you want? Excellent question. My name is Alexander Petrov, but please call me Alex. I'm here because my scout, Deb here, said that he saw the two of you in the woods earlier discussing some sort of cure. And I'm sure you can imagine my interest giving our collective situation. Look, we know as much as you know. We were simply told to go out and find a plant. Our guy thinks he's close, but I don't know if he's found this cure you're looking for. We don't usually take too kindly to strangers, but given our exceptional circumstances, I'm sure our group would take in your sick, if Roke ever does find a cure. Better plan. You give me your flower, or else we will burn this place and everyone in it to the ground. Get out. Fine. Have it your way. But I'm sure we'll be seeing you all again very soon. How long is this gonna take? I still don't have a timetable for you. I'm still trying to verify if there's enough A and T in here to actually produce a cure. I saw those men on the security feed. Who do they want? They were looking for that, and the rest of the cure. Why can't they just bring their men here? He scoffed at the idea. He wants what we have and all to himself. What does he want with a cure all to himself? Maybe to be certain that we weren't withholding it from his people, so he wanted it just to be sure. No, he wants it all for himself. Must be some sort of god complex. With the way THP3 is spread, a cure can be manipulated. He'd have the power to choose who lives and who dies in the palm of his hands. Well, let's slow down. I'm not even sure if it works yet. It's all strictly experimental. For all I know, it can induce pulmonary edema, or cardiac arrest, or fry the brain instantaneously. I have no idea. If he thinks that this plant can produce a cure that can weaponize, he sure as hell will be back. I'm sure they will be. You do what you can to control things in here, we'll take care of business outside. But Spencer, work fast. Deb. Yes, sir. I... <coughs> we are running out of time. Get the men, load the truck, let's roll out. Yes, sir. got a bad feeling about this. We're outmanned and outgunned.
We just don't have enough firepower to keep this place safe for very long. I know. But we have to keep Spencer in the lab safe for as long as we can. When we settled here, we promised these people we'd keep them safe and fight against this disease. We've lost a lot of people to things we cannot control. Rolling up to the compound now! But if we don't stay and fight, we're not doing what we promised these people. We've armed everyone willing. We just have to keep that lab safe. You see anything up there? No, nothing. Hey, are you guys going to the lake tonight? Yeah, man. Who are you taking? Everyone. We got we got a 36 pack of beer and everything. They're cut. There's nowhere else to run. Just give me what I want, and I will just walk away. Thanks for all the hard work, Doc.
I need this more than you do. Thank you for saving me, saving us. <laughs> 